Effective Sync Placement Mechanism for Multi-Sync Wireless Sensor Networks Mr. Rajana No. 1, Dr. Shiva Murthy G. Asterisk 2, Dr. G. Var Prasad No. 3 No. Research Scholar, Department of CSE, VTUPG Center, Madanahali Abstract, Wireless Sensor Network, WSN, contains hundreds or thousands of these sensor nodes. These sensors have the ability to communicate with each other or directly to the sync node. A large number of sensors in the phenomena increase the accuracy of sensing and coverage of phenomena. Routing is one of the critical issues in WSN's researchers proposed routing protocols for single sync WSNs identifying the location of the sync placement in the multiple sync wireless sensor networks is a challenge. In this work effective sync node placement mechanism is proposed by verifying the node density, the number of hops needed to route the data from node to sync node is minimized. Keywords multilink, WSNs, energy efficient, sync placement, node density. I introduction recent advancements in microelectronics and mechanical systems, MEMS, made cost-effective radio-enabled transducers introduced. These are also called sensors and also known as a sensor node. The sensors are capable of sensing, computing, and communication. It has also had optional mobilizer, location-finding systems, and energy harvesters. These autonomous sensors self-configures a wireless sensor network, WSN. These WSNs have few hundreds to few thousands of sensor nodes. The number of sensor nodes in the network is varied depending on the requirement of specific WSN's applications. Larger the number of sensor nodes in the network covers the larger geographical regions with acceptable accuracy. In most of the applications of WSNs, sensors are randomly deployed in the phenomena or region of interest. As the WSNs are infrastructure-less networks, sensor nodes coordinate among themselves to produce high-quality data or information about the physical environment 1 2 3. These sensed data communicate to the common sync node or base station. These sync nodes may be a static node or having mobility that has the capability of reaching all the nodes in the network and connecting the WSNs to an established infrastructure-based network or to the remote data storage through the Internet. The WSNs have shown its importance in a wide variety of applications. For example, military applications like target identification and intrusions detection, environmental applications like agricultural farm monitoring, precision agriculture, habitat monitoring in the forest, forest fire detection, health applications like remote diagnostic systems, medication reminders as well as medical devices. Reminder systems 4-5. It also includes healthcare systems like predictive diagnostic systems, biomedical feedback control systems, and telemedicine systems. Another area of application is like monitoring home appliances, monitoring elder people at home. It has its importance in the construction industry for monitoring material strength monitoring, managing construction inventory, monitoring construction quality, managing office building, etc. In WSNs, sensor nodes are interconnected or self-organized to form a network. Sensor nodes send the data to the sync node through multiple hops. It has the following advantages, in single sync sensor networks, the nodes which are near to the sync node may exhaust its energy sooner than the other nodes in the network. The nodes with less remaining energy and the heavily loaded node may participate in the routing. These situations are avoided in the multi-sync wireless sensor networks. Most of the applications in WSNs have thousands of sensor nodes and phenomena. Sensor nodes in WSNs with thousands of nodes need to send the sensed data to the single sync node. Single sync node in such a large number of sensor nodes is causing a high end-to-end -end delay, usage of high control messages in the network, and results in increased energy consumption and reduced network lifetime. Multiple sync nodes in the WSNs are an alternate to these problems of single sync WSNs as in Fig 1. WSNs with two sync nodes. Today's application of WSNs usually contains a larger number of nodes in the networks. All the sensor nodes in the network communicate the sensed data to the sync node. Unfortunately, existing routing protocols for many to one communication are inherently ill suited to enhance efficiency with scenarios where a large number of sensors in the network 10 12. This paper proposes an effective sync node placement mechanism by verifying the node density, the number of hops needed to route the data from node to sync node is minimized. The rest of this paper is organized as follows. In section 2, discusses literature on multi-sync WSN's background on. The theoretical model is presented in Section 3. In Section 4, sync placement mechanism is discussed. Results and discussion is presented in Section 5 and we conclude with final remarks in Section 6. To literature review many researchers proposed the energy-efficient routing protocol for multi-sync wireless sensor networks 8-17. The major issue with multi-sync wireless sensor network is how to place the sync nodes in the phenomena and balancing the energy cost uniformly across the sensor networks. In this section, sync node location mechanisms are studied. Many researchers presented their mechanisms to place the sync node where a larger number of nodes in the network. Few researchers identified the location of the sync node based on the node density. Renke ET.AL14 proposed QoS routing protocol for multi-sync wireless sensor networks. QoS routing method based on field theory for the QoS guarantee in WMSNs. The method abstract the WMSNs as a gravitational field inspired by the sync node. Each node in the network has a corresponding potential, which represents the distance to the sync node. The intermediate nodes select the next hop node according to QoS evaluation function. Under the guidance of the potential, all data will eventually flow to the sync node. The proposed multi-sync QoS routing protocol can spend lower cost to establish the QoS path compared with SMR, and our algorithm also can lead to more rational energy distribution among nodes and higher energy efficiency during data transmission. The proposed protocol not discuss the multi-sync placement and how the energy is minimized. 
Energy optimized routing algorithm for multi sync wireless sensor network is proposed by Haifeng Zhang ETL 18. The virtual potential fields force of the sensors is considered for data routing. To achieve load balancing and low energy nodes in the routing, potential values of the nodes were used to balance the energy consumption among the sensor nodes. Nodes with less residual energy are avoided to part of route between sources and sync node by adjusting intermediate nodes' potential value in residual energy potential field. Authors set the node as low energy node when its residual energy is less than 10% of the initial energy. In the routing process, the low energy node with fewer hops is avoided by adjusting its potential value and the node with the same hop will be selected as relay node. The avoid strategy for low energy nodes and load balancing strategy for multiple sinks are adopted to achieve effective balanced energy consumption. Huawei ETL16 proposed listening and ant colony optimization based routing protocol for multi sync WSNs. The ECOMS RA identifies and establishes the routes and its maintenance by means listening. Ant colony optimization is used to update pheromone and select the route between the sensors and sync node. The ECOMS RA reduces the energy resources in route discovery and its maintenance. It improves the route reliability using the power control and listening mechanism. The QoS optimization of multi sync WSNs is achieved. The proposed protocol not shown how the energy efficiency is achieved in the routing and balanced energy distribution is not shown. Jayashri ETL17 proposed WSNs architecture. The WSNs is divided into a number of clusters. Multiple sinks are used to reduce the energy utilization of the node and increases the network manageability. Every sensor node in a cluster is allotted to its sensed data to the designated sync node in order to ensure efficient usage of the sensor nodes and sensed information. The proposed energy efficient QoS routing, EEQR. Protocol addresses the end-to-end -end delay requirement and throughput of real-time data and non-real-time data respectively to the designated sync node. The proposed EEQR is not justified how the energy efficiency is achieved and how the multiple sinks are placed and selection of sinks among the multiple sinks are not shown. Due to 10 ETL18 proposed a distributed traffic balancing routing algorithm is proposed for multi-sync wireless sensor networks. It distributes traffic from sources to sinks. Distribution of traffic based on the node's gradient field. It is used to find the neighbor node to route the data to the sync node. The traffic through the neighboring nodes and distance cost from a source to the respective sync node is in the node gradient index. The nodes forward the data using a gradient search for routing and providing optimal paths and possible congestion on the path from source to corresponding sync nodes. The work balances the traffic between the source and destination by identifying data congested nodes and distributing the data through idle and underloaded nodes. Zhengma ETL20 proposed a spatial query processing algorithm for multi-sync WSNs. The proposed algorithm reduces the data messages to be communicated in the network by effective query processing. It reduces the energy consumption and minimum response time of query processing. A data collector node in each region collects the data and aggregates the data to sense the data to the next region. For achieving minimal energy consumption and minimal response time, our query processing model ensures that the nodes capable of execution of a query are involved in the query execution. In 19 authors presented the work on to detect the density of nodes in a region that is communicating through a wireless medium. The node density function D, R, measured in nodes per M2. To define it, let us take a set A of incremental size A, that contains the point R equals, X, Y, and covering N, A, nodes. The node density is defined as the limit D, R, equals lim. A point zero N, A, slash A. Formally, this limit is equal to zero in all. Locations are, except in those where nodes are placed, where it is 8. It assumes that there is a range of sizes A such that A is, I, small enough to contain a uniform part of the network, but also, 2, sufficiently large so that the number of nodes within the set is very large and the ratio N, A, slash A is stabilized to a finite and positive value which we take to be the limit. Bulusu ETL19 presented the effective localized algorithms to detect the density of the network itself. They sync node placement when threshold hop count is 5 when number of node is 200. The experimentation clearly indicates that, when the number of nodes is 100, and its threshold hop count varied between 3 to 5, the number of sync locations identified is 4, 4 and 3 respectively. Also, when the number of nodes is 200, and its threshold hop count varied between 3 to 5, the number of sync locations identified is 5, 5 and 4 respectively. The result shows that uniform coverage of sensors nodes in the network. It is seen that all the sensor nodes are binded to at least any one of the sync node in the network. Clarity on which sensor nodes is connected to which sync node is need to be studied. Also uniform sensor nodes distribution based on their resource utilization also need to be addressed. Conclusion This research work being carried out in the direction of achieving the sync placement and sync node selection mechanisms in the WSNs. The study identified that placing minimum number of sync nodes in the WSNs is a NP hard problem. Near approximate mechanisms is proposed. The proposed sync placement mechanism identifies the sync position by calculating the node degree and closeness. It clearly the indicates that the sync placement where high density nodes are located. It is also taken consideration of placing the sync nodes having a minimum number of hops away from the each sync node. The novelty in sync placement is to by measuring the node closeness or node neighboring index. The node degree and closeness is supports to identify the location of the sync node to be placed. The placement of sync node mechanism which enables a sync node communicates with number of nodes. The future work will be to investigate further optimization of sync nodes and further better communication among all the nodes in the WSNs. Also uniform sensor nodes distribution based on their resource utilization also need to be addressed.